right, hey guys, She Detector here. So this week's video is going to be a little different. Um, most of y'all know that Hurricane Helene came through Florida um, a couple of days ago and luckily we didn't uh, sustain any damage. Um, but people just like a mile down the road from us lost everything, house, cars, belongings, everything. Um, Tarpon Springs suffered significant flooding from the surge from Helene and all of the beaches that I normally go metal detecting at and some of the places that I've done land hunting at were all affected. Um, the beaches that I normally hit are still currently closed due to significant damage. Um, one of the beaches that I go to put out a statement saying, or the parks, the rangers put out a statement saying that there's significant damage and it's not safe for people to be there, period, much less go metal detecting. Um, I'm not even going to try to go down to Clearwater Beach or any of the other beaches just because I know everybody got super flooded. Um, so I'm not even going to try to hit any areas. So, um, for this week, um, I'm not going to do any metal detecting, but I do want to put something out there um, for y'all. For, you know, if you weren't affected by the hurricane, thank God you guys weren't. Um, I'm sure some of y'all were. Maybe not necessarily in Florida, but perhaps even Georgia or North Carolina. I know they have been going through kind of a shit show from the hurricane. Um, the people in Asheville and up in the Chimney Rock area. So, um, I'm going to put together a, or I've put together a compilation video from some of either my better finds or my ring finds from this year, so you guys do have something to watch. Um, so yeah, metal detecting is out of the question for this week, potentially also ne next week. So yeah, um, the best you'll get is a compilation video this week, again, possibly also next week, we'll see. But um, yeah, I wanted to just let you guys know um, why there's no video this week. And if y'all were affected by the hurricane, um, I am so super sorry. I mean, hopefully it wasn't significant. Hopefully it was just minor. I mean, we lost two bushes in our front yard and that is it. That's the extent of our damage from the hurricane. So we are definitely blessed. Um, we are definitely lucky that we escaped relatively unscathed. And um, for everybody else who was affected, I'm, I mean, the most I can do is keep you in my thoughts and prayers. We don't have like first responder training. We don't have like airboats or deep water vehicles, like some Jeeps and whatnot. So there's really not much that we can do here ourselves to help others. But if y'all are able to do anything in your community, if your community was affected, please do whatever you can to help others. Um, this is the time for us to come together and, you know, unfortunately it's a terrible time when we do end up coming together, but, um, yeah, so if you weren't affected, keep those that were in your thoughts and prayers and, um, yeah, I will update you guys next week and we'll see what the environment is looking like next week. But uh, otherwise, yeah, hopefully you guys have a good rest of the day and week. And um, until next time, I will see you guys later. All right, guys, so I'm by this tree and I had a pretty strong grunt, so I dug it and I think it's a ring. That does appear to be a ring. I wasn't even gonna record it because I just found a tent stake, like right here. And then the grunt was right there. Maybe that's a ring. It could be a ring, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's a ring. All right, guys, so I've got pretty solid target here. 23, 24. Uh, it's showing about three bars deep. I'm hoping it's not foil. Okay, I missed it. I missed it. Oh, it's the 
Check it out, guys. Check it out. Oh, found a ring. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's it. Yeah. Ooh. Says I love you in it. Nice. I don't think I see any other markings. I don't feel any other markings. All right. Put it in here. All right. Found a ring. Time to go home. <laughs> yeah, I think that's it. I don't think there's anything else. Hmm. Alright guys, so there's something here. It's not necessarily a good target. A junker. <laughs> Boo! It's a junker, but, but, it's a ring, right? I mean, probably a, well, no, I guess it's probably a regular, like a hand ring, I guess. Yeah, that's why it sounded, yeah, it, I was hesitant to dig it. Yep, because it, it was grunting, but it sounded close to the surface, but there was a little bit of a good hit in there too. Check it out. Nice. So the whole thing, I thought it was seaweed. Want a scallop? Hmm, I found a chain, guys. I don't... That could be silver. That is silver. That is a silver chain, guys. Check it out. Nice. Oh, it's leaving all sorts of a mess on my hands. Oh, silvery mess. Ooh, yep. Nice. Awesome. I thought it was seaweed. <laughs> Let's check it out and see if that's it. Yep.
All right, guys, so there it is. High tone, 30s or so, showing three on the depth. Let's see what it is. Hmm. Try it right here in the center. Oh, wait, I see it. I see something metal. What is this? I feel like I wish I had a bottle of water because this looks like a ring. This is indeed a ring. What? Of all the things I expected to find over here, ring was nowhere on my list. Like, not even a little bit on my list. What? Oh, it looks like whatever stone was in here is missing trying to get some of this dirt out yeah so it's missing a big stone but check it out guys I found a ring I found a ring doing some land hunting what oh that's awesome that is stupendous guys check it out and I can't tell if there's um, any markings there's something else so let's put that right there there's something else in here. Maybe it's still down. Okay, so there's nothing else in the hole. There's nothing. Oh. I'm trying to stay away from my watch because I know my watch is going to set stuff off. So there's something else over here. Let's dig here. Ugh. Mm, sounds very gritty in there. A big bolt. So that would probably be the grunt that I heard right before finding that beautiful ring. All right, so I believe I got everything. So we'll tuck all of this back away. Tuck that back in. I know it's not pretty I know you guys are gonna get on to me about it you're making a mess it looks terrible I know I'm terrible <laughs> I'm terrible at the land hunting I'm sorry but it's gonna rain and it'll cover it up <laughs> all of the dirt will settle into the ground all right so yep just looks like a dookie bolt and this beautiful ring I'm assuming I'm assuming this is not silver or white gold or anything. It's got like a little bit of rust on it. So I'm assuming it's not a precious metal, but it still looks beautiful, doesn't it? Look at that. How lovely is that, guys? Woo! Nice. This might be my first ring dirt hunting, I think. 
Oh, and looks like it's actually might be broken right here. Looks like there might be a little crack, and I don't know if you guys can really see that in the camera. I'll try and get some pictures of it once I clean it up, but looks like there might be a little crack or something right there. Yeah, that's awesome. I found a ring with a dead double score battery. <laughs> nice. All right, guys, so still in the trees, and there's something blowing up in here. Jumping kind of all around, but probably right on the surface. I don't see anything immediately. No way. Huh. Wow, all right. Uh, there's somebody kind of near me, so I'm not gonna like freak out. But check it out, guys. Oh, I don't immediately see any markings. Uh, oh, it's a guess, ouch. It's a guess bracelet. I don't even know. Is Guess even still around? Are they have they gone bankrupt? I don't I don't even know if they're still around, but check it out. Nice. This is awesome. I've been kind of having a crap day as far as targets go. So to find that, like right here. Like barely under the sand. And you know, there was another detectorist. I don't see him anymore. He was checking out the trees. I mean, he was out here though. I don't, I didn't see him ever come into the trees. So evidently he missed out. So thank you, my good buddy, for staying out in the open. <laughs> I'm gonna keep checking this area and see if anything else has, uh, I don't know, slightly sunk under. So there's this strap too. I'm gonna take it on my way out. Oh, wait. All right, so there's this strap. I'm gonna take it with me on my way out, but normally people will string up hammocks between the trees. And I turned around and I just saw, where did it go? Oh, right there. Look. <clears throat> yep, I bet somebody's hammock broke, potentially. Yeah. Nice. So perhaps the bracelet is from the hammock person? People? I don't know. That's great. All right, I'm going to keep checking in this little area. 